Hello everyone, I am Torior and welcome back to Let's Play House of Iron 4 with the new Together for Victory expansion. And we're playing as India. Well, actually we are British Raj still, but we're going to become India, if all goes well. We also have a lot of um, political power and the national focus to select. Mm, I think I should probably go with the extra manpower. I think so. It's going to be quite useful. Let's do that. We have a lot of population, so that should prove quite useful. Yes, that is going to be very, very useful. Let us continue. We are producing more and more units, deploying them as soon as possible. Oh, right, I have extra political power that I didn't use. Of course I do. Mm, let's see. Tank designer, no. Ship designer, not useful. Aircraft, not yet. Material designer. Motorization, artillery, or small arms. Small arms will become useful soon. Industrial, electronics, or industrial research time. I probably should have gone with this earlier. Let's take that. And the theorist. Mm. I might, I might go for that a bit later. For now, this is enough. Also, I do have enough army experience to add specialized brigades to my units. It is not really viable at the moment. Concentrated industry has been buffed. Improved machine tools are probably the way to go now. Let us continue. I think I should probably go with free market as soon as I get um, free trade, as soon as I get the points to do that. Also, we are going to become fascist relatively soon. Lord Linth mm, Linthgow. He doesn't have any special buffs. Okay, then. <clears throat> right. Deploy. And deploy. Okay, Amelia Earhart circumnavigates the globe. Cool, thanks. I mean, yeah. And this will give us extra manpower in f three, two, one. Okay, where's that manpower of mine? Where is it? Oh, currently has no effect. What? Seems like I need to gain my independence before I can use this. This seems... Well, that's underwhelming, isn't it? World tension is still too low to do all the things that I want. Pilot training, not that important. Infantry weapons, soon. Engineers technology, not that important. Hmm. Let's see. If I were to research this... And use the bonus for 10. Yeah, that could work. Let's do that. This will be done in, what, 50 days? Let's do this. Vickers Berthier gun. Marco Bridge incident. World tension still too low for me to do anything. Unfortunately. I guess I could go to free trade. Because I'm not really using all the resources that I have, I, and I do have a lot of them. Produced, exported, I'm not using any. Almost. I'm just using a bit of steel. Hmm. Yeah, I'm going to... Because we're getting quite a lot of factories from that, from trade, eight factories. I'm going to change that. I'm going to change my trade to free trade. That should give me some extra factories soon. Why isn't it giving me that? Okay, wait, 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 wait. Civil war for fascism. I could start a civil war. Civil war seems like a very bad idea. Let's wait for the support to develop more. Okay, why did I not get more factories from trade? I mean, nobody bought those things yet. 
Maybe nobody bought those things yet. I still get a construction bonus from that, so it's it's fine. And I didn't get the extra manpower, unfortunately. I guess I could do one more division. And then you guys will get retrained in the field. Yeah, that'll do. Although I don't have to deploy the last... I actually didn't need to deploy the previous one either. We'll have them fully supplied, and then I can um, possibly improve the machine tools. Okay, what's what should we do next? I could do excavation. That could get me more factories from trade, but it is not a certain thing by any means. This is... Oh, right, this is what I was supposed to start. And then when we're done, we'll use the bonus for something else. The Great Battle Plan. Yeah, I feel like... I should continue that. Just continue the doctrine we're already working on. And the extra construction research. It's the year 37, so this is all ahead of time, apart from the excavation, which is not as important. Uh, this is ahead of time, but might still be worth it for other research purposes. 3% all across the board is quite useful. I could also do this equipment. And I think I will. In terms of military, this is going to give us quite a tremendous boost. Okay. Finally. Finally, there's enough world tension for us to, to pursue our independence. I need to start working on that right away in 10 days. 9, 8, and so on. Our independence is still going down. Effects on autonomy, country. Hmm. I'm not sure how that works exactly. Okay, Japanese... Yeah, world tension is going on, and Japan declared war. And our new national focus is finally going to be provincial elections, which gives us more political power. And lets us pursue our independence with all the other ideas. And we have the buffs to our guns, which we will use shortly. Japan is attacking everyone. I guess I could attack China as well. If I had the means to do it. I could, theoretically. Oh, right then. Uh, how is my... The threat of communism. Okay, fascism has a lot of popularity in our country now. 50. There should be a coup soon. Mm, now, I need to make... to become a friend of Germany. I have a lot of political power. I guess I could spend some of it improving relations with Germany, with the Soviet Union, and with the UK and France. It seems... seems reasonable. Although it might not be time yet. Maybe this power is better spent elsewhere. Also, am I getting more from trade? Yes, finally I am getting more from trade. Perfect. I need my independence. I need my independence soon. And then I'm going to start training my units once they are reinforced properly. And then we'll take over Iran and Afghanistan. And possibly Turkey, if we do very well. And from there, we could team up with Germans and attack the Soviet Union and actually take over all the territory, because it would be coming from our land. Or I could attack China from the other side, or all of the above. I'm not sure I can beat Turkey, though. It will be very tricky. Still, when we achieve independence, we'll have a lot of manpower. Okay. Uh, should I deploy the last unit? Oh, it did auto-deploy already. Fine. Uh, assign all the divisions here. Should say 12 divisions. Where is that? No, sh yes, here it is. Nomination, be super aggressive. Make sure everyone is assigned. And a new machine gun has been developed. I'm not, I don't want to research this, because I want the buff to go towards the better weapon. Okay, now I can focus my research on... I think computing machine is the wise choice here. 
Let us continue. Italy announces claims on Yugoslavian territory and we have our provincial elections. Now, this basically brings us closer to the United Kingdom while being friends with them and this brings us closer to our own independence. And this is what we're going to do. We're going towards our own independence and I have enough points to do something to modify the government. Do I want a theorist? Naval, military, air warfare and or nuclear. This one's not available yet. Land Doctrine Research Time 7%. That would be useful. Oh, actually, I'm researching small arms. This is going to be even more useful. At least at the moment. And, yeah, let's do the Doctrine guy as well. Then I might... Uh, I will probably also employ the infantry expert when I have the points for that. Yay! Fascist Assault Division. Perfect. Recruitable population has increased tremendously, which means I am going to recruit even more infantry. Wait a minute, what is this? A Sikh regiment? It's just a normal regiment. Oh, it is different. How is it different? For some reason, Indian Division is better than Sikh Regiment. I have no idea why. In theory, they are the same, but I'm going to train the Indian Division. Hmm. Let's do the Indian Division. Location, um, sure, Balochistan. And I feel like I just want to fill this army up. So this should be sufficient. Okay, this is the highest priority. Prepared defense is ready. Let's do Grand Assault. Yeah, Doctrines are very powerful bonuses. I could theoretically fight China, but it's probably not the best idea. Mm, Alright. We should have a fascist coup anytime now. I wonder if it'll actually help us... If it'll actually help us with um, our independence movement or not. Provincial elections plus 100. Country minus 84. Minus. Yeah, I'm going as fast as I can in terms of trying to get the independence. In the meantime, I might want to deploy the guys, although maybe I'll wait. Let's let them get their training. I can always mass deploy them. And finally, we're going for the better weapons. How's my construction? Yeah, doing a lot of civilian factories. Then I can focus on military ones, maybe. Still, I do like my civilian factories quite a lot. Let's wait for now. Let's wait for now. I want better construction technology, and I want better production technology. Commonwealth Research. Each member with a tech tree reduces time by 5%. Whoa, 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 whoa. Swaraj movement makes um, gains in provincial elections. Freedom is within reach. Perfect. The Anschluss of Austria has happened, and we have gotten the Swaraj movement. Now, I could do the Quit India movement, which would give us daily autonomy progress increase, or I could do All India Forward block, which would move us towards different ideologies. Um... I'm not sure. It seems like this is a very good thing. We can get it quickly and get more autonomy. I also want to seek help from Germany. Wait a minute. Do we have any event here that will make us independent immediately? Mm, no. No, it doesn't. <clears throat> I'm going to seek help from Germany, I think. But first, let's do the Quit India movement. Call for the British Raj to leave India. It is um, inconceivable that the Raj can end before the war is over. But the situation on the ground is growing more tense by the day. Huh. Okay. Mm. I'm not sure if that will separate me. I'm not sure if that will separate me from the rest of my territory. All India forward block. Huh. 
I think I'll no, I think I'll start with this one instead. It's not a big difference anyway. Hopefully I can stay out of the war between uh, the Allies and Germany. Hopefully. If we can get our independence before that happens, then we'll be free to pursue our own goals, pretty much. Within reason. Oh, I could go with partial mobilization. That's interesting. War economy would be better. We'll soon turn to a fascist party, though, so that can be... Yeah, that'll be perfect. Let's save up some political power for that. Let's not use it right away. Oh no, I set it on infinity. Only wanted to do it once. Only wanted to do it once. Oh, right. Yeah, I have a very few military factories, but it's still going to be okay. Hmm, yeah. Japan, how are you doing? Japan is not doing as well as I would expect. Actually, they're in a bit of trouble. In a bit of a pickle. Okay, how's that focus going? All India forward block. Perfect, now I can do this and this. I think I'm going to... Hmm. Yes, I'm going to ask... Germany for help. Because they want to join them and destroy the Soviets or the Allies. No, that's sad. That's a bad idea. That's a bad idea. Can, you, can you stop that? Can I abandon the focus? Hmm. I changed my mind. It's too late. Let's continue. I can always... I can always betray them if I so choose. I don't need to join their wars. That's a lot of political power, I should use it somewhere. Although I will need to apply the proper economy once we change our government. War economy is the one I'm thinking of. And I will need to change our manpower law to extensive conscription. That let us get lots and lots of troops. Then again, I don't need the conscription law immediately, so let's go with the infantry expert first. Yes, coup can be executed, and the support is sufficient, so the coup should happen very, very soon. Where's my coup? Support is over 50%, so... 61, in fact. Yeah, that's gonna be... Quite easy. And the Sten has been completed, the research, that is. Okay, the year is 38. It might be time... No, this is too early. I think I'll do excavation. Outdated equipment produced. Thank you. Let's do Sten. We'll get some better weapons. Yes, um, okay, we have a lot of support, but there still hasn't been a coup. Why? Also, we have finished our computing machine research, which increases our, which increases um, our research times, um, decreases our research times. I should probably research radio now. And some support battalions and such. Atomic research is tempting. Now it's too early for that. Let's do radio. Let us do radio and then... And then we'll buff our economy and our infantry a bit more. In the meantime, how's our independence? Not too good. The German Reich takes up our cause. British Colonial Office. Hmm... Seek help from Germany. Perfect. Now I'm going to do... Um, I'm not sure what the Indian National Army is. I'm not sure what this is. I don't know my history well enough. I could... Seek support from the Soviets, apparently. Hmm... 
What the, oh, what this console? Let's do that one. In the National Army. In the National Army, the German Reich will support their cause. Maybe that will grant us our independence. We're still a colony. And they are very much against us gaining our independence. Okay, okay, it's finally, it's going up. Our independence movement is working. Finally. Still far from a success. Grand Assault Doctrine finished. Okay. Do you want to do Infiltration or Assault? Mm, all Infantry and Motorized Mechanized. Planning. Breakthrough. Organization. Planning. Motorized and Mechanized. And this is Breakthrough for Infantry. Tanks. Less Supply Consumption. Night Attack. Organization and recon company buffs. I think infiltration is better for us. I might be wrong here, but let's do it And I can again modify the government I'm not sure I want to Chief of army could be useful army defense division defense 10% experience gain and no Morale useful drill not useful offense Okay, either morale, recovery rate, or offense. Let's take offense. It's going to buff our guys quite significantly. Okay, then. I should probably start doing those military factories now. That should do it. That should indeed do it. How's our focus? Indian National Army. I'm not sure what that will do. We can build it in, in regions free from British interference and line up against the Allies. Sapping Indian manpower from the Raj. Interesting. The Fourth International. Mm, fascist support. Autonomy progress gain increase. Cool. Yes, great. Let's unpause. I want to use the Germans to fight the Soviets. France and Britain announce alliance can be problematic. We have bypassed British pilot training. Indian National Army. Oh! Oh! Wait a minute. Where's where's my where are my troops? Did you get all my troops? Did they get all my troops? Please don't get all my troops. It would be horribly stupid. So we're at war with free India. Oh, sorry, we're at war with India and we are free India. Is this trying to... S oh, damn it. Did I, did I just screw myself over? Seems that way, certainly. Okay, let's let's explore this possibility. It seems completely bad, doesn't it? It really, really does. Munich Agreement. So I'm, I'm apparently at war with India. I am the defender. Soviet withdrawal, radio finished. Would you like to join me? Oh, I am in a faction with you. So this is a civil war then. Good to know. And I'm also going to lose it. I guess I could do excavation too. Do you have any armies? This suddenly seems like they do. Are they the troops that I had? That I just had recently? Do I even have the generals available? 
Desert Fox and Hill Fighter. Sure, let's take this guy. But I am not at war with the British. They are here, but I am not at war with them. This is a civil war. Okay, let's see if all armies were eliminated, or... If I screwed myself over by placing them in the wrong places. Attack. Go on. Alright, it's kind of working. No, just go for Delhi. Just go for Delhi. Can I deploy more troops? No, not right now. You're taking attrition? Doesn't matter. Just go for Delhi. This is a necessary step for us to achieve our independence completely. Then do it. Maybe I'll regain our troops? Who knows? Okay. Did I get my troops back? <sighs> Seems like all that production was for nothing. It's really, really weird. This, did those troops automatically go to the British? No. Why do you have... Ah, I, I'm not going to try and understand what happened. Okay, do I want the German technology? Yes. Yes, I do. Yes, I do want German technology. I should have gotten that. Fo I should have started the focus earlier. Okay, let's fire a fascist demagogue. Oh, he's actually the leader of the country. Let's fire him. I could replace him with a backroom backstabber. Or no, let's just fire him for now. Let's change our economy to war economy. Let's change our manpower laws to extensive conscription. We don't have that ability yet. We don't have enough political power. That's fine. Okay, now it is time to attack Afghanistan and Iran. At least we are free. I have a lot of manpower. And I'm going to use it. Where are my factories? Need more military factories. Deploy. Okay, so all that production was for nothing. I sh should have saved those weapons. I This doesn't really make sense to me, but whatever. Where did all that army, where did all those weapons go? I have no idea. This, this is quite weird. Well, it is, um, it is a pre-release version. It's a review build, so build, so... Some hiccups are bound to happen. So, um, how are we doing with that uh, production? Not too good. Need way more than I have. Hmm. Well, we are not ready to attack Afghanistan in that situation. But I could start fabricating a war goal against them. Two hundred and forty days. Let's see if anyone guarantees them. Nobody has guaranteed them. I should probably improve my relations with France and the UK. Because they might guarantee them. And we wouldn't want that. Now I'm also probably going to justify war against Iran, but let's wait a second. Okay, let's do it now. Doesn't matter what you select as the war goal. Let's do Sistan. Did anyone guarantee them? Damn it. France just guaranteed Afghanistan. Crap. And they guaranteed Iran. Well, screw them. Could just attack China, I guess. I'm not sure what I should be doing in this situation. I'm not sure what I should be doing in this situation. I might want to attack the communists instead. Or I might want to just start a war with the allies. 
I'll think about it. In the meantime, it's time to end the episode. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you soon. Goodbye.